y'all to figure out what y'all gon' do about it. Big wheels keep rolling, rolling. I'm outside, 29, G5, Seaside. I've been losing friends and finding peace. But honestly, that sounds like a fair trade to me if I ever heard. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Barbie Stacks, the big one, not the little one. If you are a turn subscriber, welcome back, baby. If you're new here, do not forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave. So today's video is gonna be a strip vlog, y'all. And today is hold on, let's see what today is, okay? <laughs> let's see what today is because I do not want to be telling y'all today is a day and it's really not that day. So today is October 12th, y'all. It is Thursday, y'all. But if y'all don't know, if y'all didn't watch my last vlog, I had left and I went back home. I went to New York or whatever to go visit the family. But y'all, when I came back home, I had mad boxes sitting in front of the door y'all when i say mad boxes literally one two three four four boxes sitting in front of my door waiting for me y'all so your girl is gonna do a, this big huge unboxing on camera because i'm like why not you know what i mean i'm not gonna lie to y'all some of the stuff i opened because i couldn't contain myself okay <laughs> a lot of stuff i did not open so i'm just gonna open it on camera so i can show y'all what i got you know what i mean <laughs> y'all when i tell y'all it's a whole lot of stuff y'all it's literally a whole lot of stuff let me show y'all let me show let me stop doing so much talking and let me do some shit with okay <laughs> Y'all, so this is all the freaking stuff that your girl came home to. Y'all, this is mad stuff. Okay, y'all, so I think I'm going to set my camera up right here so y'all can see me. Hold on, can y'all see me? Check in one, two, three. Thank you. <laughs> so um, let me just start off with... Oh, freak, I'm dropping all this freaking stuff, y'all. Okay, y'all, so where the, where the hell do I start, okay? That's the question, where do I start? All right, y'all, so I got a lot of stuff, okay? I got some stuff from Sheen. I got some stuff from Amazon, okay? So we just gonna dive straight in, okay? This ain't about to be no specific order. Let's just go straight in, okay? So let me show y'all these cute sunnies that I had bought off of Sheen, y'all. And I did end up getting like four of them, y'all. All right, y'all, so this is the first pair that your girl got. Mad cute, right? Yeah. <laughs> so I had got this color, y'all. I had got this color. These two colors right here is actually like my favorites. I think they're like mad freaking cute. And then I also got the OG black and white. You know what I'm saying? You always have to get a black and white pair. Like I just feel like whatever you get, if you're going to get it in different colors, you always got to get the original, the OGs, the black and white that can go with everything. Okay. These are the sunnies that your girl got. Super freaking cute. I don't know for Sheen, y'all. Okay. That go to Sheen right now and go get y'all some. Okay. <laughs> and then I also got a whole lot of accessories, y'all. Like, so I had got these pair of earrings, y'all. Super freaking cute. And then I also got them in gold. I think the gold is eating, okay? The gold is eating them up. Huh? What happened? Look, <laughs> I also got these earrings, y'all. Mad freaking cute. And then I got me some uh, triangular puffs, y'all, for my makeup. I don't know. I love the triangular puffs. Like, I just feel like they work better. You know what I'm saying? Like, I definitely was using my beauty blender for a long time, but I had to hop on the try, baby. Because, oh, all right. <laughs> Let's just open this package up, y'all. freaking cute oh my god so your girl had ordered her some jeans off of posh by v y'all i don't know what posh by v is like are y'all look like living under a rock <laughs> like are, i love posh by v they have like really really good quality clothes y'all but the only thing that y'all might not like about it is that they're kind of expensive i think for like these jeans just one pair of jeans y'all i think for these in particular i paid like 70 dollars for it and then the other, this other pair that i have i think i paid like 75 for it. so yeah all together i paid like 150 for two pairs of jeans okay <laughs> but they're really good quality and they're really, really cute so you're gonna end up getting these jeans right here y'all super freaking cute i don't know why but i'm really into like graphic jeans right now if it's a graphic jean like i want it these are the other jeans that i had got y'all that i told y'all i think i paid like 75 for i think those were 70 and these are 75 but i just thought these were really really cute so i ended up getting me these really cute heels y'all i thought these would be really really cute with like a cute jean a cute top you feel me if i'm going out to dinner and i want to dress up and dressed down at the same time like i could probably like throw a pair of jeans on and then throw on this heel i think it's super freaking cute and super freaking comfortable y'all like then i had got this cute sandal y'all mad freaking cute okay <laughs> yeah and when i ordered all this stuff it was a little hotter too by the way i don't want y'all thinking like girl why did you get sandals and 
and we in fall y'all <laughs> when i ordered this stuff literally it was it was still hot outside and i honestly really wasn't thinking like yeah it's about to get cooler but i could still wear them and then i ended up getting these sandals y'all super freaking cute and i said if it does get cold sooner or later and i can't wear them i can always wear them next summer then i got this sandal y'all in the color white They're, they are the exact same sandals as the brown ones they're just in white super freaking cute next i had got this hat that says god got me period because he do not play about your girl okay y'all so listen to me i know you're gonna be mad at me i know i know i just know y'all gonna be mad but just listen okay so i was gonna do this unboxing on camera y'all but look at all this stuff okay literally look at oh. <laughs> look at all this freaking stuff y'all like this is mad much bro this, so besides showing y'all everything i think i'm just gonna show y'all like a couple okay can we just do a couple <laughs> so before y'all eat me up in the comments your girl did get some stuff for fall so i ended up getting me this really cute jacket y'all it is so freaking cute if this doesn't scream fall i don't know what screams fall like ooh, yeah super freaking comfortable super soft like what like what yeah this is mad cute <laughs> This is a freaking mad cute and it's definitely giving fall. It's giving fall and it's giving winter. Then I just got this really cute turtleneck, all white. You can't go wrong with that. I'm not gonna try that on y'all, nah, cause I do not want my makeup to get on that. If my makeup get on that, I'm gonna be very upset. And then I got this two piece, y'all. Do y'all see the full colors? Yeah. <laughs> so I ended up getting this two piece, y'all, in this olive green with this matching top, super freaking cute. Then I had got this long dress, y'all. It's like a winter dress. It's definitely thick for the quality. It may look, and I feel like this is gonna be really, really cute with like a cute boot, you feel me? Then I had got me this long dress with the sleeves, y'all. It's super freaking long. It goes all the way down to your feet. It's gonna be really, really cute with some boots and like a cute scarf or something, y'all. The outfit's gonna go crazy, okay? Trust the process, boo. As bad as I wanna sit up here and show y'all every single thing that I got, y'all, I kinda don't at the same time because I definitely wanna save some of this stuff for this sheen haul that I plan on doing on my channel, which I think y'all really, really love. Let me know in the comment section below if that's the type of stuff y'all want to see from me because i know like y'all usually used to seeing me like doing just doing stripper stuff but like i told y'all in my other video i want to step out of the side of the box i want to start doing the not so normal you know what i'm saying like but y'all i'm about to clean up all this freaking mess and then call it a freaking night y'all because i am freaking sleepy okay it's just been a long freaking day y'all tt is tired okay <laughs> imitation is a flattery it's just annoying me and i'm too about it in the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil and I grew up by it Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gon' do about it Big wheels keep rolling, rolling I'm outside, 29, G5, Seaside I've been losing friends and finding peace But honestly, that sound like a fair trade to me If I ever heard one and I'm still here Outside, front line, south side I've been losing friends and finding peace that sound like a fair trade to me Look, don't invite me over here if you throw another pretty party Looking back, it's hard to tell you where I started I don't know who love me, but I know that it ain't everybody I can never love her, she a busybody Baby, if you want me, keep it turning up with everybody what's up you guys so today is the next day y'all today is saturday october 14th and your girl ended up not going to work last night i don't know if i told you i was going or not but i ended up not going to work last night because time was not on my side okay it literally was not on my side i ended up going to the fair yesterday y'all and going out to eat i didn't stay at the fair that long because what i went there for wasn't at the fair and i was kind of irritated about that because me and my girlfriend was supposed to get our pictures drawn and the dude that draws the pictures wasn't even there so I ended up just getting us a smoothie and we ended up just dipping out okay and then she had took me to the seafood restaurant y'all oh oh my god y'all the food was so freaking good i had got shrimp lobster crabs potatoes corns y'all the whole nine i got the whole nine okay the whole freaking nine like, you already know your girl don't play okay but i am a seafood fanatic like literally i freaking love seafood like literally grew up eating seafood like when i was like a young young kid y'all your girl was eating snow crabs okay <laughs> That's just what it was like, y'all. Yeah, and the food was bomb.com. Like, oh my God. Like, I'm going to tell my girlfriend next time she get paid to take me back. <laughs> I'm going to try to take me back because it was so freaking good. Like, what? <laughs> By the time I got done doing all that, y'all, it was super freaking late. So I couldn't even go to work even if I wanted to because how far I was from my job and from where I stay at. <laughs> but your girl is going to work tonight, y'all. Like, I got done doing my hair and my makeup. And I think I did a really good job, y'all. What y'all think? <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, I think it look really freaking good, y'all. And I'm coming to take all y'all money tonight, okay? So, so y'all, the goal tonight is, y'all need some money, okay? Your girl needs some coins, okay? I have not been to work in about, it feels like three weeks. Even though it's been one week, it feels like about three weeks, no cap. So your girl need a big, fat, crazy, stupid bag tonight, all right? When I say stupid, I mean retarded, okay? I mean special lead bag, okay? I need a big bag. So your girl's banking on a thousand dollars tonight, y'all. A thousand really ain't a lot of money, okay? If we gonna be anything, let's be for real. Like a thousand, a band? really ain't nothing for real okay so we are banking on a thousand dollars tonight y'all wish me a fat crazy stupid bag okay because your girl needed it right the bills is due <laughs> okay the bills is motherfucking due wish your girl a fat crazy stupid bag y'all i'm gonna stop talking so i can hurry up and get on this road y'all it's going it's getting late y'all already know i don't play by my sip out okay so i'm gonna see y'all when i come back from the club <laughs> What's up, you guys? So today is the next day, y'all. It is Sunday, October 15th. Happy Sunday, y'all. <laughs> so your girl just got back up from her nap, y'all. Well, not even nap, because I went to sleep. I was so freaking tired last night, y'all. Like, y'all have no idea. I barely made it home, okay? When I say barely, barely made it home. But y'all, let me tell you about the club last night before y'all show y'all this money count. So last night was kind of slow. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. It was it was very much slow. And it was blowing me because the money came so freaking slow. Like it was so boring. At a point, I was just ready to go home. You know what I'm saying? I was ready to go home because I was like, bro, this has to be the slowest night I've ever made money. Like the money came so freaking slow. So I was in a section last night, right? And it was like this dude, I think he played for like the NBA, the NBA, him and his homeboy. They had came to the club. So we in a section and they had paid security to um, block off the section or whatever. And I knew this dude from before because I danced for him one time before this time. And the other girl knew the other dude. So it was three girls, me, my homegirl and another girl, right? So the whole a whole lot of girls run up to the section. They trying to get in the section, right? Roaching, roaching. So one of the girls gonna tell security, let me in the section because management told me to come over here. I'm like, baby, that's not how this work. You know what I'm saying? That's not how this work. Like, management can't tell you what section to come in. Like, this management didn't pay for the section. You feel me? That's why I be, That's why this club really be blowing me because I feel like they be having a whole lot of weird stuff going on. Like, how he's telling you to come in the section and he ain't pay for the section? You know what I'm saying? So when he had told, oh, dude, did you speak to such and such about such and such getting in the section? He was just like, nah, I ain't speak to nobody about nobody getting in the section. The only girls I want in the section is the girls in the section right now. I only want three girls. So they made a big old problem about them getting in the section i'm like dang like this man don't even he didn't even pull no money out yet that was that was my whole thing he didn't put no money out yet so why y'all going so crazy over this section y'all don't even know how much he gonna pull out you feel me well he ended up pulling out a good bit of money though but it wasn't nothing to go crazy about like literally it wasn't like i was kind of irritated about that because they were trying to get in that section so bad y'all they was roaching so bad i'm talking about the section right here in the middle y'all why they had girls on the side of the sections right trying to finesse money so they could throw money over there i'm just like baby it don't never get that deep it don't never get that deep it really really don't they didn't throw them a dollar that's what they get stop roaching stop trying to get every single dollar that you can like it's not cute you feel what i'm saying you standing outside of the section shaking your butt for dead life trying to get a dollar like that's why they didn't throw y'all nothing. Absolutely nothing. And I'm happy they didn't. That would have been me. They would have wanna fight. Okay, so I'm glad they didn't throw them no money. Stop roaching. Like it's never that serious. Like the club was slow, but it wasn't that slow to where that was the only people in the club. You know what I'm saying? Like that wasn't the only money in the club. So for y'all to really just be fleeing over that section was beyond me. And another thing that annoyed me about the section was one of the dudes was just like, I'm gonna do another round. You getting some more money? And so the other dude was just like, nah, I'm just gonna throw this. All he had was three hundred dollars, y'all. He only got three hundred dollars out. His homeboy got like six hundred dollars, right? So the dude that got the six hundred dollars was like, I'm about to do another the round you getting some more money out so he was just like nah bro i ain't getting no more money out he was like how much you about to do he was another round about to get another 600 so he was like nah i don't think you should get no more money out so i'm just looking at him like what you feel me like what you mean you don't think he should get no more money out so the other girl was like why are you telling him that like he's trying to have fun like if he want to get some more money out let him get some more money out and i'm like right like how you gonna sit up here and tell the next man i don't think you should get no more money out that sounds gay as hell like that sounds so gay to me like why is you watching the next man pocket if this man want to spend his money let him spend his money like it was so weird to me like i don't know when dudes do that like nah don't get no more money out bro don't don't get no more money out twin it gives they sleeping together you know what i'm saying like <laughs> it gives they sleeping together vibes because why are you so worried about about the next dude throwing money on some girls like that's i don't know that's really really weird y'all he blew me with that like i'm not even gonna lie to you so he ended up getting another round the other dude was sitting over there in the corner with his arms crossed like this looking like he was mad i'm like you too sassy for me sir i can't i'm sorry baby you is way too sassy for me why you mad this man got some more money 
You know what I'm saying? Is he paying your bills? Is he sleeping with you? Why are you so mad that he got some more money? I feel like all men is suspect. Like, that's just me. I feel like all of them are suspect as hell because it's like, I don't know the stuff they be doing. It just, it, it just give red flags to me. All right, y'all. So let me show y'all this money count that we made last night, y'all. So this is what we made last night on a Saturday, y'all. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, $900. So last night we made $900 on a Saturday, y'all. $900 on a Saturday is actually not bad, y'all, because the club was so freaking slow last night. Like, you was really lucky to run into some money last night. Like, I'm not even gonna lie to you. Like, if you ran into some money last night, you was definitely lucky. And I guess I was one of the chosen ones, okay? <laughs> But yeah, I am not going to work tonight. I'm just super freaking tired. I have so much work to catch up on. I'm just, oh my God, y'all. It's just, it's just absolutely a lot. Like, I just feel like I'm just so backed up on everything. Because when I had went back home, I came back. I just had so much to do on top of things I already had to do. So your girl is not going to work tonight, y'all. So we are almost at 10K, y'all. <laughs> We are almost at 10,000 subscribers. Like, that is really crazy to me. Like, I am literally, like, 500 subscribers away from 10K. Like, what? <laughs> like, what? Like, that is so freaking crazy to me, y'all. Like, every time I think about it, I just be, like, so freaking shocked. Because, y'all, like, literally, last year, I created my channel, like, last year. Like, literally, last year. And already, like, within like, 15, 16 months, your girl is already at 10,000 subscribers. Like, that is really crazy to me. Like, <laughs> Like, I love y'all so much. Thank y'all so much for rocking with me. Thank y'all so much for watching my videos. I love y'all so much. And like I told y'all before, when we hit 10K subscribers, I'm going to do a giveaway. I'm going to do like a wig giveaway. I think I'm going to do the wig giveaway details in the next video. Make sure y'all keep it up with me so y'all can win that free wig. Okay, period. <laughs> I love you guys so freaking much, y'all. This is going to conclude the video. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs>